Good morning, Vietnam. Uh, <laughs> this is uh, this is Kyle, or AKA Vulcan Wolverine, and it is Sunday morning, uh, at the end of the weekend. It's like eight o'clock on. I'm not sure of the date. I think it's like April seventh or something like that. No, no, no. April seventh was Friday. Seven ninth. It's April the tenth. Um. I just wanted to make a video this morning because I got hit pretty hard last night. Yesterday, I got hit so hard in the left side of the head that it was like I had to crawl in the bed. And I really couldn't move. I was like um, just so disoriented. And it was just like this pressure on the side of my head. But um, I, I, I see the pictures that everybody's putting out like a burn marks. And I, I do... Like, I think that sometimes they hit me so bad that it does leave little red marks. Um, but I don't get a lot of that. I get, you know, my skin is kind of red. But, like, I mean, they hit me in the side of the head so hard. And I, and you can see, it's like there's, there's not really any marks on me. Uh, it hits the deep tissue. And it feels like my, it feels like I'm underneath is, is microwaved. Um... And then I want to show y'all kind of, like, this is the shirt I'm wearing. It's one of my grandpa's old shirts. He passed away. It's real, real thin. And, uh, like, you can see the Q-Wave Defenders poking through. I got, I even got one, um, I got, I even got one clipped, uh, where there's not a pocket. And I put it in. But I want to, I'm just going to warn y'all, I'm going to, uh, to lift my shirt. I'm not going to show anything really bad but it's like look at this this is what i wear i mean i'm like darth vader or something um see i got that one clipped up there and then i got the two around my neck then i got like uh i think two in each pocket so i got seven on me total with the q-link little thing and two um two shungite things but it's like they're hitting me in the throat hit me in the throat to where it felt like I mean yeah, I see a little bit of red you know and it could be irritation of the skin a little bit uh, but I feel it mostly underneath uh, like choking or like uh, like gastric acid um, you know and then on the chest they hit me right in the middle of the chest and let me move my electronics over uh, it's like you can see my chest and I'm sorry, guys, if this is, like, a little bit too much. But I, I want to do this because it's like they hit me in the chest and it hurts. It's like it hurts down deep inside my chest. Um, but it doesn't make it doesn't make any visible marks that I can see. Um, I think sometimes it makes my, my attackers make little marks. My skin gets a little bit irritated. But they're not like burning holes in me. And I know that some target individuals are experiencing that. Like they're experiencing, uh, I guess, the like lasers or masers that actually make, you know, little burn holes. Um, and I do have something. This is like, I, I took an Epsom salt bath and so this gets irritated. I don't, I don't think this is from a directed energy weapon attack. I think they did hit me over here so hard that I did actually get um, irritation around here. But um, I, I just see, I see, uh, and he won't mind because James Lyko is really out there. He's really, he's supporting me, He's and I support him. He comments, and he's really trying to, to get in front of this. Um, so, like, I don't mind saying his whole name. Please check his videos out um, because he gets red burns all over him and i think it's it's a certain way they hit you or maybe uh some people's skin even the stuff that i'm getting hit with it reacts a different way um i really think my theory is and please comment on this comment on you know why some some ti's get the burns like on their skin you can see it um, and then other TIs, it's like more of an underneath, like, cause when they hit me so hard in the side of the head and they just came right through here and it was just like, um, I mean, it felt like it, I mean, it felt like it was drilling through to my brain. Um, so, so excuse me if I'm discombobulated again, like, I mean, I just woke up so that, that too, but 
you know, being tortured all night, you wake up and you, you put yourself back together. Uh, it gets really old and tiring, and it's just like, what, you know, what are we doing here? What is, what's going on? But we got to do it. I mean, we can't just lay down and die. Um, too many people are getting hurt. But um, I just wanted to show that, like, kind of what I have here. And I'm sorry, it, I mean, that, that's what I walk around with all day. And this is a, a really thin shirt, like, so it kind of shows through. And I, I knew that, and I just kind of don't care right now. But usually I'll, like, I'll get a pocketed shirt, put one in. Um, after I did this, though, like, I was experiencing a lot of that. Like, yesterday I got hit in the head so hard that it was burning all over my head and pressure to where I couldn't even stand it. Like, I couldn't even do anything. I had to just go lay down. And, and put my headphones in. I got some headphones yesterday. They don't like that a lot. I lost my other pair of headphones. Uh, like, I don't know if they were taken uh, by gaslighting or somebody took them out of my car. Um, you know, that's, that's a possibility. Um, I may have just lost them because it was like after a movie and I think they may have fell out of my pocket. Um, but I went and bought a new pair and it's like, it's these Skull Candy um, headphones, they're skull candy, like, noise, uh, not noise cancellation, but, um, it disables, even if you put them in without music, it disables a lot of that, and I find that, that that's a really, really important thing, um, you know, keeping, if you keep headphones in all the time, it's gonna make their job harder, because they're listening, they are listening through our, they hear what we hear, so if you blast them out, like, their their whole remote station is going to have music coming out of it you know and they're going to have to like turn it down so they're not going to be able to surveil uh audially it is is easy or they're going to have to listen to whatever you listen to um so you know i i, I find that you know they're gonna they're gonna try and condition me with pain and torture uh i'm gonna try and condition back you know, with some music uh, that that I like that inspires me. Put that in their ear all the time. And, you know, little steps, little things uh, that don't just crush this program down. I, I want that. If God sent me a sword and, and it said, this will destroy this program, and I could just, like, fling it and it would end this, like, that would be awesome. Um, I Come on, God, send it to me, right? <laughs> but uh, but uh, in lieu of that, <laughs> in lieu of that, uh, you know, we've got to keep making making little inches, like keep moving forward. Um, it was a great conference call last night, the 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 big uh, FFCHS call. Um, you know, Dwight uh, spoke again about grounding and magnets. Um, you know, I I uh, I have a grounding blanket, but I, I like I I asked him. I was like, you know, you can you can go buy what you're talking about, but he did make a point where it's like if you ground with um, with solid material like copper or aluminum, um, it's touching your skin directly. With the blanket, you do it works. Um, it does work. Like, it, it definitely does work, but you still got that fabric, and you've got stuff within the fabric that grounds you. Um, so it does, it reduces, I guess, the power of the grounding um, to where you're getting, like, maybe a half of it or something like that it, than if you made something yourself. Um, but, I mean, it's, it's, it's better than nothing, nothing. It's kind of a climb up. I'm trying to, like, see if... I get hit really hard, but mine, guys, it's like... They don't burn holes in me. Um, you know, I, I think they do that for a reason. I think I have a protocol. Like, because if I show my parents, like, marks on me that were definitely from them or my psychiatrist, um, you know, I, I, I don't know. Uh, but, I mean, other TIs, they've showed that, you know, they've showed their parents and their friends, and people do find justifications to, to not believe that, you know, that maybe they scratch themselves or you know, something like that, some ridiculous stuff, just any justification not to, not to change their lives, not, not for the, for the normal people not to change their lives, because this is so bad, um, but I wanted to do that this morning, because, like, they, they were hitting me really hard, like, in the chest, in the throat this morning, um, last night, it was so, I mean, it's like, 
I'm trying to explain the feeling when they hit me. Um, and I, I know I've done it a million times, and it's, it's harder right now because my brain feels like a filet mignon, the six six ounce one, not the nine ounce one. <laughs> At least I'm laughing this morning. Um, and uh, so so I feel I feel pretty burnt, but it's like it's like the nerves and the muscles underneath. Uh, it, like my jaw, sometimes they'll hit me in the face to where, like, if I'm sitting around somebody, they'll move it to my face and, like, my jaw so that I, I can't, like, I'll talk, but I'll sound, um, like it'll be, it'll be hard to kind of move everything. And I feel like, um, I feel like, you know, since they do hit joints and stuff like that, I feel like maybe they were hitting, hitting that joint, like, right, right in my jaw. And it was like just really, really putting pressure on it. Um, but it, it's like a, a burning sensation. Uh, like my muscles are tired, like after a workout, but it's also like they've been cooked. Um, and then the nerves are kind of like the nerve endings are just like all screaming in pain. I, I, I put a Facebook post this morning uh, to kind of try and describe it. But, you know, I do, I see the TIs, and there are a lot of them who get, and, and you know, women who explain that they have, like, you know, dime-sized holes that these people burn in them. Um, and, you know, they use different stuff on all of us. So, I mean, that, that's, that's explain, I mean, that, that explains that a lot. Um, I kind of wish they would burn me all the time with holes like that, because I'd keep showing people that. But then I, but then I talked to a TI who that happens to, and I was like, you know, did you tell your parents? Did you tell? And, and you know, she told me how, you know, they find justifications to be like, you know, that's just you, you scratch yourself, or that's nothing, or it's uh, some kind of just skin thing. So even if they did do that to me, I don't, I don't know if that would be a, a censure. But I don't think they, they risk that uh, on me. They can hurt me real bad without really showing anything but a little bit of redness on my skin. And I showed y'all uh, the other morning, there was redness, uh, there was irritation, um, but it wasn't like like huge burn marks or sunburn, it was just like my skin being irritated. And it, it probably was from them hitting me. Um, this definitely was, I know that. This, somebody had commented like, that could just be you slept on that, but I don't sleep, I sleep on my right side um in the bed so it couldn't have been that but i just wanted to make a video this morning i just want to tell y'all like i'm putting myself back together every day i put myself back together um you know some nights are better than other nights um you know they switch things up some nights they'll give me really really strong directed dreaming so i'll wake up and my mind will feel like really weird uh but my body will feel i'll feel energy in my body uh and some nights they'll focus on um you know hurting my body and i won't get so much directed dreaming and stuff like that so it's like i i feel like they do have to put a lot of power on each thing since i do defend um that's what my uh attackers do my attackers have to put all the power on one thing like, if they really start hitting me with the high-pitched sound, um, you know, I'll notice that the V2K will be, you know, the V2K will uh, kind of um, slough off, I guess. It's the best. I'm trying to think of words this morning. So, you know, watch me. That's kind of funny. Watch me try and find the right words. Um, but they do. I know that. I know that for a fact, that they do. They put more power into one thing because I do have defenses. If they kept everything at the same level, uh, my defenses would cover that. So they'll they'll put all, whatever kind of, you know, however they hook it into their remote system, they'll put one thing, they'll focus on one thing uh, for a while. Um, I do like this morning, you know, my, my next door neighbor, uh, right when I woke up, I was waking up, getting ready to go out. And it's Sunday morning, it's like, you know, and now it's like not it's actually like nine i woke up at like 7 30 um but he was he was dry he drives out at the same time that i wake up every morning like i'll be going out and like and then and, and sometimes he'll walk out like 